Hello everybody, welcome back to the Mindset Channel. Today we are going to be doing a WWE, sorry, 2K17 career mode with the one and only Brian Pillman here, as you can see on the screen. Um, they didn't have fly-in or loose cannon, so he is fly Flyboy Brian, because they also did not have Pillman in the game either, so... You are now looking at Flyboy Brian, but obviously his name is Brian Pillman. So, WWE 2K17 had the great feature of letting you use custom characters in career mode that you have made previously. So, um, like now you have to, you when you go into it, then you have to make a character specifically for that. Well, now you can... On well, 2K and you know WWE 2K17, you can um, take uh, a wrestler, making it go into making a tire, um, and then they'll ask you like, "Do you want to make this say in a, a custom attire?" You say no, and then you have your own version of this character that you can now play as in career mode, and that is great. So we are gonna go. We can't do. We can't do anything. I don't believe. I mean, what can we do? We can get rid of a shirt. Oh, so we can put. I didn't realize that. I didn't realize we could actually just put his clothes on him. Right off the bat. Now I love Brian Pillman, but I didn't really, really get into Brian Pillman until I watched. I started watching 1997 Raw. And as most people probably know, that is when Brian Pillman sadly passed away. So, I don't have too much of a knowledge on Brian Pillman. Um, but, we're going to figure it out. We're going to have a fun time uh, you know, playing as him. There's his tights. We get rid of these knee pads. These shoes are... Shoes are awful. I'm going to search real quick. I'll try to make a Brian Pillman attire. This one is the one I'm kind of going for is the flying Brian Pillman, um, which, you know, really just the shorts. Um, you can see here some just white boots. Gonna give him some knee pads. Just some black knee pads, nothing, nothing crazy, nothing too crazy. All right, and that's all we're actually going to be allowed to do. So here we go. And we now have to deal with 2K17's very, very long loading screens. Which is, you know, which is fantastic. It's a great feature of WWE 2K17. And I think 18 had, like, really bad ones, too. To WWE. Every week, WWE superstars entertain millions across the globe. 101,763 WWE fans on hand. But how did these superstars reach the top of the mountain? Were they born into greatness? Genetically superior. No. Like you, they began at the bottom and climbed the mountain one step at a time. And you can't teach that. Before you step on the grand stage at WrestleMania, before you set foot on NXT, SmackDown, or Raw, you have to prove you have what it takes. Now is the time for you to dig deep, to push yourself further than you ever have before, both physically and mentally. It's time to give it everything you've got and show them the superstar you can become. This is WWE, and it's time for you to earn your place. There we go. Some nostalgia back there. Haven't seen that in a long time. Trying to make it back to his feet, but he's being stalked by a 
his opponent. Watch out here. Look at this. Double drop kick right into the corner. Oh, man. He's in big trouble now, and it looks like. I think he's feeling it. Yes. He's going to the top, Cole. This isn't going to be pretty. Ah! Oh, right to the midsection. That'll break the rim. This could be Some a good time in NXT. Oh, Look, there I am. Very out of place. I look very, very out of place. Well, he earned that win. This guy's coming into the arena he's wearing, wearing ring gear. His model is interesting. <laughs> it's definitely not what I expected the Brian Pillman to look like. But obviously, they, they couldn't get a face scan, so... You know, forgiven. They're forgiven. And now for the long loading screens. The next day. Oh, there's copyrighted music point in the background. Hopefully YouTube doesn't hear it. <laughs> All right. Very awkward conversation. And I'm the only one wearing Bring it in. real ring gear. I believe that's Jan Jet the blonde. The what you saw last night, looking dude. it's not talent. It's hard work. Guys like Finn, Kevin, and Sammy, they ran the same ropes you're running. They did the same training that you are all about to do. There are no advantages like talent and luck. The only thing that will separate you from the pack is how hard you're willing to work for it. You do that, and one day you might find yourself with that same title you saw Finn hold it. Okay, now pair up. I want to see what you got. All right, here we go. We're going to get some matches in. Let's do this default move set. Give him a good stomp in. Let's do some more moves to show off a little bit. This dude's got nothing on me. I came in ring gear. Show me why you you should have known I'm serious by me ring wearing ring gear. Oops. Doesn't matter though. That's what we want to see, I agree. The problem is <clears throat> I'm very weak, so all this stuff I'm doing to him is doing nothing to him. We'll get there eventually. Just have to beat him up for a little bit. Come on, come on, Jaden. What are you doing to me? You can do better than that. Oh, we're rolling. Now he's hugging me. Get the fuck out of here, Jaden. I 
mean, that was getting tough. Now, now he's actually fighting. You already know I'm going to the main roster, Jade, and bank off. All right, this was like 2020 WWE. I'd rather go to NXT, but I know too. There's a chance that you'll be on a tag team. I better not be on a tag team with Jade and Jet, or that's getting broken up instantly. Man, I really hope, I really hope the music isn't heard from YouTube. Oh, that did not go well, whoops. Show me something. Make it happen. Get out of here, Jaden. Six one nine. Nope. That'd be so cool to give Brian Pillman a six one nine. I don't know if that's in this game or not. I'm not too sure. That'd be great if it was though. It might be. Even though Ray's not, it might be in the game still. Looking good. Well, basic ass signature. And time for a basic ass finisher. Look out, Jaden. Get fucking pinned. Let's go, come on. Okay, don't let up now. Two, three. Yeah, fuck you, Jaden Jet. Pretty good for a rookie. Your wrestling is solid, but not exciting and definitely not on the level of a WWE superstar. Over the next few weeks, we'll be working on solidifying your wrestling style. If you nail that down, we'll talk about the next steps. Now go take a break. Not exciting. Does he know who I am? Does this man know who I am? Matthew Bloom. Mr. Train. Al. So now we're going to be fighting Samoa Joe, it looks like. What does it take? Samoa Joe. I think I probably could have used my boosters and I would have made things go a little bit quicker. I did not do that on accident, but. It takes great athleticism. The attitude adjustment! How's he doing it? The Swiss Superman! Wide uppercut! Strong ring psychology. What on earth? Can you imagine looking across the ring and seeing Bray Wyatt coming at you like that? Bray Stanton locked in! And the ability to make the crowd your own. The Yes Movement is in full effect. You must always strive to improve your skills. My goodness, you're not... <laughs> Only when you excel at all of these things will the WWE Universe embrace you as a true superstar.
No, I don't listen to this music. Come smoke okay, now. this is it. We want to see how you fare against a real superstar. Show us what you can do against Samoa Joe. This is your first real test, and it will tell us where you stand. So take it seriously. You ain't nothing on me, Samoa Joe. You ain't nothing on me. We're flying. Fly boy, I should say. Try, try to do this as quick as I can. Come on, Samoa. Mr. Joe. Joseph. Smo Joseph. I got nothing to say. Just over here trying to beat up Samo Joe. Just punching the hell out of him. Come on, Samoa Joe. I also might have... I'm not sure if I have... What I have the game set as. Like, rating-wise. So... <coughs> Sorry about that. I might have... But I might have to change it. Go get it. Oh, the big kicks. Don't listen to music in the background. Not that it really matters because themes are probably going to get my videos demonetized anyways. I, you know, it's just you can't play, play a wrestling game without the themes, you know? So I guess all my videos with wrestling themes are going to get demonetized for the most part, which sucks. But, you know, we have to do, we got to do what we got to do. Man, just kick the hell out of me there. Okay, don't let up now. Why is this dude yelling at me? I'm doing everything I can. Pin. Not pin. I meant to say taunt. Sometimes words just don't come out the way that I I'm thinking. That took a while. You can do better than that. Let's finish him. And pin him. One, two, three. He kick out. What a bitch. Just put my face right up to the mic there. What a bitch. Punch him real quick. Punch him. Oh, oh shit. All right, let me taunt real quick. I'm going to take a poop. Stop the ground. Oh, over the rope. No way. No way, dude. 
No way. Not being pinned today. No, not being submitted either. No, thank you, Mr. Joe. Okay, don't let up now. Put him on the mat. Come on, Mr. Joseph. Looking good. You got you got nothing to gain from this. Let me win. Let me win. One, two, three. Oh, dude, what the heck, dude? Both times I pinned him. The the ref counted three. Make it happen. You better take this fucking pin, dude. Take this pin. One, two, three. We did it. Ignore the music. Okay, pretty good. So sweaty. Still room for improvement, but a decent performance nonetheless. Keep doing what you're doing, kid, and you'll be a WWE superstar in no time. He was a WWE superstar. Go ahead superstar. and take a break. You've earned it. Oh, my sweaty self going to take a shower. Long loading screens again. All right, can I? Is it too late to do all that stuff? Looks like it is. I'll go. We're doing legend. Unlock all reward items. Yeah, let's turn it. Turn on the my player Kickstarter. Is it? I probably. It's not going to matter right now, anyways. Because I'm just doing promotion, self promotion now. I think for the next, next two time, next two things. Superstars are more than top level athletes. They are masters of the microphone. Give me a hell yeah! How you doing? You want some? Finally! The WWE Universe is larger than life, and you need to be larger than life as well to win over the crowd. If you smell! Will you be their hero? What the rock is cooking! Or will you give them a villain they can believe in? I didn't need you to win the title, and I don't need you to get it back. Just as it is in the ring. Idiot! Sometimes words themselves become the battlefield. There's only one word to describe you! You have never beaten me. Because you can't beat me. Because I am better than you. Or you may find yourself squaring off with the authority itself. Now I'm the authority. You see, you don't own them. You will respect me because I will be the face of your company. But no matter how you decide to cut your promo, one rule holds true. Go big or go home. Austin 316 says I just whipped your ass in the million. The chill is here! Now that's pretty cool. Look at Rock, Rock's tongue. It's going crazy. Okay, being a WWE superstar is not just about being a good wrestler. You have to be charismatic. We're going to let you do your first promo today. We'll pretend to be the crowd. If I can give you one piece of advice, 
every crowd in every city is different. Putting on a good promo is all about working the crowd. Keep that in mind today. Time to, time to make a great promo with all these preset words that they give me. All right. Get your cell phones out. Take your photos. Send your texts about me. This is a once-in-a-lifetime thing for all of you. I mean, I don't think you'll be able to afford the next one. By then, I'll be such a legend, tickets will skyrocket. You all should be grateful that right now. Open them eyes wide. You're looking at the next a big thing. So remember this moment. Breathe it in. It'll be the best in your life. What is he talking about? Oh, that was not good. I'm here to proclaim my unabashed respect and alignment with the authority. Through them, the WWE can return to the respected company it was before it fell into the hands of the thugs in the back who call themselves superstars. And as their chief supporter, I will, to use a phrase you can all understand, take out the trash that is the majority of the locker room. It didn't really give me any good option, I don't think, but... I'm tired of everything being the same around here, of the same opportunities being given to the same boring superstars. I've worked hard for everything I've got, and there's no way it's going to be for nothing. I want my shot, and I'm not giving up until I get it. I don't know what's going on here. <laughs> Mother Nature's final child. And I've got it, and I've got no concerns about my wishes being fulfilled. I've I always get my way. It's just the way the universe works. I guess I'm Mother Nature's favorite child. Man, I suck with promos. I really do. I'm sorry. I know, I feel like that, it didn't give me, the one I said about the authority, I feel like it didn't give me much, so I thought, Kid, you know. Natural. Oh, thanks. Next week, we'll really see what you're made of. So be ready and be sure to practice up. The dude doesn't feel in the shot. But I was going to say, I feel like I don't, didn't give me a good option there. Probably did, and I just did misread something, but... I don't know. I felt like it was either authority or a face thing to say. So I just said something about the authority, because, you know, that would make people angry at, you know, 2017 time. <laughs> I mean, pretty much... The authority is pretty much done by 2017, but... The game still was kind of pushing it. Loading screens. Get ready to... Destroy Enzo here. And we'll, I think after this we'll be able to see where we go. NXT or main roster. Hopefully main roster, but NXT will be alright too because this was a fun year for NXT. As you can see, Enzo over there is already ready to go. Look at those blue Today shoes. You're putting on a promo against him. These promos are all about outwitting your opponent and wowing the crowd. Today, I'll play the part of the crowd, so wow me, kid. This is going to be cheering and booing. That would be pretty cool. Don't listen to the music in the background. It doesn't exist. <clears throat> Having to get my reading ready. My reading voice. Hey, I was perfectly happy sitting back there in the dressing room with everyone waiting on me. But I was so amused with what he was saying that I thought it might be fun to come out here. And it's going to be more fun handling him his teeth. Handing, not handling. <laughs> You've got some testicular fortitude to come out here while I'm addressing my legions of fans. Whatever it, Whatever it is you have to say... 
whatever it is you have to say had better be important or we're going to have a serious problem. Maybe it's just me, but I don't think the grammar's right. <laughs> Maybe it's just me, though. What? You don't have what it takes to make it as a superstar. Tell you what, though. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm feeling rather, rather generous. So come work for me as a cook. You can make me pancakes whenever I want, and I'll even save you some scraps. What do you say? I don't think his hair will fit in the hat. I'm getting sick and tired of this. You want to come out here and say something to me, that's fine. But you damn sure better be ready to back it up. So what? So what's it going to be? And if you don't have an answer, I'll answer it for you. I got two words for you. You're pathetic. Look at you. The way you smile when these idiots give you the approval you work for. How pathetic. You're a grown man. And you let the WWE Universe dictate your life. Let me put it this way. When you're ready to put on the big boy pants, I'll be waiting right here. I'm actually going to beat him. I know how badly you want to get a piece of me. I can see that it's eating you up inside and it's going to happen. But it's gonna going to happen on my own terms, not yours. No one controls my destiny, especially not a punk like you. If if we were in the another city, maybe I'd let you get to me. But we're here tonight. I'm gonna enjoy myself, so instead of letting you get in my head, I'm letting her roll off my shoulders, bro. I'm having a good time tonight. In the great city of here. You just keep digging yourself a deeper grave with those insults. All it, all it's doing is making you, making me angrier. So go ahead. Keep putting your foot in your mouth. I'm going to use it, use mine to kick your ass. That was hurtful. After, after all that's been said and done between you and me, I'm no longer interested in having a match with you. I'm only interested in having a fight with you. I don't care about winning a match so, so much as I am. Getting my hands around your neck. And there's nothing you can do to stop me. Well, you know, that was going my way for a while, but I don't think, I think he won that. I hate promos anyways. I'm not going right. to try not to do them as much. Decision. We're going to think of a persona together and start you off on the main roster in the tag team division. Tag it's team. It's in need of some new talent, and I think you're exactly what the division needs. Congratulations. Well, bright side, we're on the main roster. Downside, we're on a tag team. And it's probably gonna be with one of those guys from the from the first scene there when I you know I got the fight. Baron Blade. Hopefully it's not Baron, but not Baron Blade. What's his name? I don't know. Maybe it is. I forget. I forget everyone's names. Jaden Jet, that's what it was. Oh, Baron, Baron Blade's not in this game. I don't, I don't think so, at least. It's been a while. Here we go. Let's see what's going on here. There are many paths to superstardom in the WWE. Will you take the high road? An incredible journey! So many obstacles, and in the end, it's all worth it. Will you take the low road? Rollins took out Reigns. What is going on here? Figure eight, flare at Sasha. Becky tapped out. Charlotte is champion. Or will you take a more unconventional path? This is my game. Will you try to win over the WWE Universe? turn the WWE Universe against you. I don't need any of you. Will you make it to the top of the WWE via hard work and effort? The impossible dream has become reality. Or will you take shortcuts? Rollins with the heist of the century. Randy Orton has cashed in money in the bank. Randy Orton is champion. No matter which path you choose, 
The most important thing is to make it memorable. Oh my god! Make the universe remember your name. Austin 316 says I just whipped your if you see me! What the rock is cooking? And make them look forward to your match every week. Who will you become? So now we're here, we get to customize ourselves. Um, yeah, really have nothing to do. Um, <clears throat> I mean, we got a good start now. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll change the tire up, maybe make him more of like the WWE, WWF, Brian Pillman, but now we're good. I don't, don't really want to change him up. So we're going to have him go there, and we're going to edit his, um, going to edit things up for him, and then that'll be it. Um, gonna make this a series um gonna be gonna enjoy this uh i won't promise but i'm saying i'm gonna do my best to keep this going <laughs> we'll see how it goes though you know i'm start. you know i start all these series and everything like that and i you know i'll play them eventually you know not everything's gonna be week after week you know I just like to come on and play games, so sometimes I play something different. And here we are. On the right side of the screen, games loading. We're in a tag team with Brody Tyson. I don't know. I really don't want to be in a tag team. I mean, I think it's just going to take, I mean, it's going to take a long time just to get what, you know, different things that we want. Um, especially because I'm going to have this. I have this, don't I? Um, yeah, I have my player kickstart. So I'm going to boost up this a little bit here. I'm going to go through and boost everything up just a little bit. And then we'll go through and, because I have no really particular needs. Um, maybe I'll make him like a aerial guy. I'm not, I don't think I'm really going to follow much of Brian Pillman's career. I'm going to make him more modern. We'll see though. Maybe give him the same finisher eventually. Cause we're not, we don't have really any real, we don't have much, uh, you know, VC for, Moves. I'll put everything to 70, looks like. And then from there, we can put things up. You know, it would be nice to have an overall, you know, just all around good wrestler. You know, I mean, it'll take a while to get everything up doing that, but... And put his reversals all the way up. <laughs> like performance. That's the bottom one, isn't it? Yep. Okay, well, so we'll put that one up. We'll go to 80. And then we'll just start from the top and go back everything down to 80 again. And see how that goes. And once I start, you know, really getting into matches and everything, I'll figure out what I want to, what I really want to start doing. Everything's looking good. All right, we'll do 
pin escape, we'll put pin escape up. Um, momentum, we'll put a momentum all the way up. Damage recovery, stamina recovery, and then the rest on stamina. All right, so we are 90 overall. <clears throat> kind of cheating, but, you know, we're just out here having fun. Um, skills. Let's see. We can't get any skills. Okay. And this isn't anything we need right now, right? Because I want, I want to save up so I can get... Like, dives and things like that. Um, but yeah. I'm going to decide what we're going to do with... Mr. Brody Tyson here. Um, but for now, that's going to end the episode. So if you guys enjoyed... Um, like I said, I'm going to make it a series, so, you know, stay, you know, keep watching. We'll, we'll, our next episode will come eventually, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.